my name is Muhammad Shakib and this is Master Deck. So today we are going to install Lineage OS on a Redmi Note 3, which formerly known as a Cyanogen mod. It's a same developer which developed the ROM for the Cyanogen mod, but come up with a different name called a Lineage OS. So let's get started. So first thing you have to do is power off your device. Then press the power button and volume up button simultaneously. It will boot into the recovery mode. Before installing this ROM, please make sure you take a backup so anything goes wrong with this ROM. So you can always restore from here. Here is my restore folder. Select this if goes and swipe to restore it will restore your system go to wipe go to advanced wipe select everything except internal storage and a micro sd card then you have to swipe to wipe then you need to go back go back then you need to go to the install and select the folder of a lineage os here is my a rom here is the lineage os 14.1 here is the date and also this is unofficial so just select this so here is uh, the lineage os rom select this and you just need to swipe to confirm flash then you have to select the gaps file and swipe to confirm flash so the rom and gaps file successfully install then you have to just Hit the reboot system. Still the Cyanogen mode logo is there. So just tap on start. And here we go. This is the Lineage OS on a Redmi Note 3. I think it's basically the same OS but with a different name so finally rom is booted up so let's go to the settings and check out what's new in this rom so here we got a go to the about and here is you notice the lineage os update so basically before then it would written over here is cyanogen mod so that's, uh, that's pretty much it and and let's check out the android version is 7.1.1 so that's that and um, the build number is also the uh, uh, 30 of December 2016 so it's a uh, year old I mean uh, just uh, two days ago so go back back to the normal so let's do an end to do benchmark on this ROM uh, lineage OS so just click over here and test this so we got the score of 81,155 on an Antutu benchmark so that's a good score on this ROM I think I would say it's basically a same ROM benchmark and the benchmark. So we got the RAM of 1 GB of usage uh, out of we got a 1.7 GB free. So that's um, a good sign. So we got the button um, here buttons. So you can always enable uh, the on screen and navigation bar from here. So this is the navigation bar you can enable from here 
you can also choose the left handed mode and show arrow while typing and all this stuff over here so let's go back and go to the other stuff so account and this is i think a cast and here we got the status bar which you can change the icon and control everything over here and you can hide or, or change the, the size of the style and uh, here is the battery circle battery status you can always change the circle text and icon landscape and quick pull down uh, you also do that if you are uh, you are going to do a right left here we go here is the right and here is the left if you enable this you will you can do from a right left or off so brightness a control option by sliding on this detail bar so here we go on this also enable this also you can you can uh, uh, control the brightness uh, from a status bar which uh, like this so i'm just going to do a simple and uh, here is the notification count and double tap to sleep so everything is same as uh, many rom so nothing special here so this is the lineage os uh, this is an unofficial build for a kenzo which means the a redmi note 3 for the snapdragon and this is all the stuff it's based on a nougat 7.1.1 so here is the build date and everything you can find over here so let's go back to the normal stuff let's go back so let me go to the camera and yes it's uh, the camera works fine on this rom let me just uh, switch to the front facing camera so it it is a buggy camera so this is a buggy camera for now let me open it again and try if it still work or not i think this is a buggy camera on this so let's assume this is a not perfect for a uh, photography yeah uh, the flashlight is also doesn't work which which uh, cases for a many rom many rom are fa face this issue so yeah after tapping a uh, 10 times you can you can on this now it's working fine uh, so these two are these two are not working perfectly on this rom so flashlight doesn't work properly and also the camera camera are buggy on this rom so let me try one more time to check if it's working yeah yeah this is working right now so yeah this uh, is working let me click a uh, selfie and the the error pop up on a continuously basis this is an unofficial bill as i as i said this is the unofficial bill uh, wait for the official build it will be a more stable uh, than that so or uh, if you have any question and query please comment down below uh, that's pretty much it for this video make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit like comment share and many more videos are coming soon on the channel so stay tuned for that and peace thank you thank you thank you for watching